Everything. This next story, uh, it may make you smile. This is the time of the year that sheep ranchers all around our great state are busy with lambing now going on. I didn't know that this was a term, lambing Me is either. going on. Okay. Mm -hmm. Wake Up Montana's David Kaplan introduces us to one sheep herder who calls Lavina his home away from home. Leo, the Peruvian sheep herder, comes to Lavina every year with his son and others to work lambs and sheep. Most Montana sheep don't understand Spanish. But these sheep do. Leo's background in sheep herding goes back all the way to working on his father's ranch in Peru. I grew up in the high mount. Uh, uh, my hometown's name is uh, Corpacancha, Peru. By working in America from around February to October, Leo is able to work with his son, his son-in-law, and provide a better life for his family in Peru. I'm happy because I have the opportunity to go, go back to my home every one and a half year. Ben LaFelt, fifth generation rancher in Lavina, has been employing Leo through the H-2A program for 10 years because it's cheaper than training someone every year and because sheep herding is a skill. When my grandpa's generation, a lot of times there were some old sheep herders around. Anymore, there's not any Americans that sort of understand the trade or know the trade, so it's important for us to find people like Leo to help us with this H-2A program um, to come as a guest worker. Ben says this is a 24-7 job as you need a night lammer, a day lammer, and feeders. He says Leo and the other Peruvian workers understand sheep husbandry. With the money Leo has earned working on the LaFelt Ranch here in Lavina, he has built his family a new house in Lima, Peru. I'm David Kaplan in Lavina, Wake Up Montana. So many cute animals in that story. I just love that. Love it. Good stuff. Cute.